What's up, folks? Sunday, April 9th, 2017. Got a little flash alert, flash break, whatever you want. Um, Sergio Garcia just won the Masters, finally breaking through, getting his first major championship victory. Um, very interesting day. You know, a lot a lot to go into with this. Now, I'm not the biggest golf guy, um, but I know enough about it. Uh, in this one, he was basically, it was him and Justin Rose uh, the whole way around. You know, uh, Ricky Fowler couldn't really get it going. He had some struggles. I believe the leader um, in the clubhouse, so before these guys just finished it up, was uh, Charles Schwartzel. Um, minus six, I think. These guys, I mean, Garcia was, I don't know how it works if he's at minus 10 or he just wins the playoff. Well, they were both minus nine. Going into the playoff and Sergio birdie the final hole. Uh, Sergio was looking dead in the water. <laughs> he made the, t I mean, I was watching it. He made the turn. Uh, they were both minus eight, him and Justin Rose, and then they put up the graphic. He was like plus 31 uh, on his final nine holes in Masters history, and then he missed. I mean, he bogeyed the first two holes right on cue. He was putting up some squares, and things looked bad. Uh, he was able to get a birdie or get a par. Then he went to a par five, uh, was in some serious business, somehow got out of it, got a five. Uh, Justin Rose, who was at that put or kept Sergio at minus six, put Justin or Justin Rose was at minus eight. He had a very short putt he could have put down for a birdie to give him a three stroke lead. Uh, hooked it left, uh, completely missed out, uh, opened the door, and then you could feel things changing at that point. Sergio went on to get a birdie, got an eagle. They were all tied up. Then the 16th hole, bolt, you know, that's a poor three bolt, would have very close. Um, uh, Justin Rose made his birdie. Sergio missed a big one. It looked like that was, you know, I thought that was it, you know, same old Sergio. But then it was the 17th hole. Again, Justin Rose with a chance on a very short putt. This was for par. He, uh, he had a one-stroke lead going into it. He he missed it just completely, completely goffed on that one. There's no other way to put it. So two holes really changed it where Justin Rose had putts. One was for birdie. One was for par putts he should have made, and he missed it. That evened things up going into the 18th hole. Uh, Justin Rose missed a much tougher putt. It was still close. They were both, you know, very makeable putts for uh, Rose and Sergio Garcia. Garcia had his chance after Rose of um, putt I was expecting him to make, and he completely, he just completely bombed on it. And I was like, same old Sergio, same old Sergio. And I wanted Sergio to win. Uh, you know, I thought he was gonna have the Mickelson moment right there, but I, you know, like a putt you just can't miss to win the Masters. Then in the playoff hole, though, uh, Justin Rose, you know, he was in the he was in the Georgia Pines after his first shot. Had trouble getting out of it, so where Sergio was on the green in two, Justin Rose was on the green in three. Rose gave it a ride, but couldn't make it, so Sergio could have two-putted his way to victory, but he was able to birdie the hole, so he really left no doubts. It's not like he really backed into it. He made the putt uh, that he had to, to to go under par, so you know while he could have two-putted, he did it in one, but he was able to get it. So hats off to Sergio Garcia, finally got it. You know What was that, 2006 or 2007, the British Open? He uh, rimmed one around. That was halfway down. Uh, give him credit because, like I said, he looked done. I mean, Justin Rose kept the door open. Don't get me wrong, but Sergio Garcia still had to. He still had to come out of that uh, par. It was a par five where he was. Uh, you know, he was already plus two on the back nine. There was a fourth hole. He was in some serious trouble. He was able to negotiate his way through it to save the five. Like I said, Justin Rose had a chance to get a birdie. He would have had a three shot lead. But, uh, you know, Sergio Garcia still had to hold himself there. He had to hold it. And, um, you know, but it, it's tough. You know, you do miss putts, but at the end of the day, Justin Rose has got to be kicking himself. And he had some serious opportunities to win this. Uh, even, you know, the last hole, he he barely missed. Now, that it was a makeable putt, but certainly a missable putt. I mean, these two he missed. The one, I guess that was, what, 12th? I don't know, 13th was the par 5. Uh, you know, that birdie, he just should I mean, these were putts you don't miss for birdie. At the par putt on 17, you don't miss that one for par. I mean, these were within 5 feet. Got to put those down. So very, very, got to be very disappointed with himself. Uh, you know, they're interviewing him now. I don't have the volume up. He looks pretty happy. I mean, 
you know, he's still probably cashing a check for about <laughs> 600 grand, so I don't think he's got too much to worry about. But, uh, you know, he, there was a, also the note. It looked like he may have hurt his back a little bit. It was twinging, so that could have affected him, but I don't know how much that would really affect his putting. Again, these were makeable putts uh, on 13 and 17 that he just he just missed, and that you know kept Sergio in it Sergio had to turn things around got an eagle uh he really bared down I don't think he bogeyed the rest of the way after that so he was able to stem the tide and keep himself together but Justin Rose hey what can you do but give Sergio Garcia credit he finally got it I mean he's still a pretty young guy he's he was only 37 he just came up when he was so young so who knows if that's a springboard him you know maybe win a couple more by the time he's 40 and then he can develop into a pretty decent career but you know we'll have to see that all come down he's got that 12,000 pound gorilla off his back so hats off and again like we said Sergio Garcia on the final hole where he needed the two putt he did make the putt in one so uh left you know he he handled it when he had to but he very disappointing when he had it on his stick. So uh, on the 18th before the playoff. The playoff hole was also on 18th, the first one. It didn't go to any holes after that. So Sergio Garcia, 2017 Masters champion. Justin Rose, the runner-up, leaving the door open with brutally missed putts on 13 and 17 to allow Sergio to get the victory. So we'll see you next time, folks. And remember, we appreciate all subscriptions. Thanks so much.